yesterday this place in Barara. And I will never forget in Barara because of this. And they, they are driving team that was here. The deliberate provocation, provocative action uh, of uh, Colonel Dr. Chiza and his group came out clear. To the honest observer, surely it should be clear who is the culprit. Mistakes of the police sometimes not understand. Sometimes police officers act recklessly or rashly and obscure the fact that in all the situations, uh, what, 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 precip what precipitates what they call police brutality is the deliberate provocations of Colonel Dr. Chiza Wesige and his deliberately organized violent group of mainly youthful supporters. And sometimes who is responsible for what does not come out. And eventually, because the police, uh, and, and sometimes also you in the media are not, uh, are not fair to the police, we now bring out what the police have done rather than what precipitated the police to act. I hope the human rights groups are also going to make a comment on this. <laughs> because also police, policemen are also human beings and they have rights. Nobody talks about it. I never had a single Margaret Sekaja who comes out so quickly saying anything about this. I think this is double standard. This is hypocrisy. He plays hypocrisy, and we cannot accept him to be punching bugs when we are doing our, our duty of protecting this country. Thank you, sir.